a good sized giraffe? Mm, they can even get bigger than that. They're, they're, not, they're still young. When they get really old, they go, the males go dark, 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 dark. So, yeah. Folks, welcome to your first hunt in South Africa, Joe. Appreciate it. Um, Joe's hunting with Johnic Safaris. Um, we own the home ranch, Woodlands. Quite a fresh morning this morning, a little overcast. It stood, should stay like this for most of the day. We're starting out, we're generally looking for Nyala and Kudu here in these valleys behind us, and then hopefully go and chase a few planes game before it gets too late and the wind gets up. But we've uh, got a few animals on the list for this hunt. Um, hopefully we'll get most of them on film and big thing is to have a good time and enjoy yourself man and whatever else comes with that will be gravy. So welcome, enjoy yourself. Looking forward to it. Hope to have many hunts together. Yes sir. Cool man. Right so we just seen some Nice herd of blessed buck males over the top here, but they are hard to beast with them. We're going to walk over there, see if we can sneak over and get close to one of them, have a look, see if there's anything worth shooting. Let's see if we can get a look at one of those. It's quite nice. You got one in. of his back, don't put any air between it, because it's going to drop a bit, it's right on 300. Yeah, put it on the top of his back and squeeze one off. Like that, it's a good shot. <laughs> yeah, well done, Jack. That's awesome, man. Let's go a bit closer there. This is the guy we wanted. Oh, that's nice. That's very nice, dude. Man, well, well done, yeah. Put it there. I appreciate Congratulations, it. Congratulations, man. That's a bless. We see the males have got these scent glands here and they got the what in the white horns and he's got nice white horns. Mm -hmm. No, he's way over 16 inches. Very, very nice. Well Joe, day one, one animal down so far. It's a bless buck. There are plenty of these. Um, it's not the difficulty in finding them, it's the difficulty in getting them to stand still, as you saw today. So we've been hard at work after them this morning. Eventually we three sort of left the herd and we made a stalk on them from a dam. Very nice blessed buck, a nice secondary growth here at the back, you can see it. Very prevalent throughout South Africa, a good one to start off with. Man. 
first of many to come. Well done, man. Congratulations. Thank you. Awesome animal. Winds got really cold. Well, for us it has. You probably don't feel it too much, but the animals have too. So it was a bit quiet this afternoon. Sun's going down, and it's going to be, get dark pretty quickly as it does in Africa. Um, but we've had a good day. We're looking for Nyala this evening. We didn't see any today. I saw a few this morning, but we'll give it a go and get back on the horse early tomorrow morning and have a look for them. We might go to another area. I'm just going to see what the guys are doing back at camp but we might head slowly back to the pickup which is over the hill here and take a drive on back to camp and get warm get it again tomorrow well done man thank you good Driven a little ways from Woodlands um, base camp to Fort Beaufort area. Uh, for the ranch here is a friend of mine and he, he's been seeing a really big Nyala bull. So we hope to see if we can find him in the early mornings he comes down up the mountains. We're gonna go and have a look for him. It's pretty nice and fresh now, but the wind is gonna get up, so hopefully we can get him sooner rather than later. Otherwise it'll be this evening sometime again. So let's go see what we see.
Yeah, hit him good. Jump across to the next lane quick. He's in the next lane. So good hit. I hit him in the front shoulder there. Yeah, that's a beast. Huh? Yeah. Thank you very much. Yes, well done, dude. Thank and you. Awesome, man. Awesome. Wow. Look at that. Wow. <laughs> well done, dude. Thank you very yes, much. Yes, that's nice. Look at the mud on his horns and. The Beautiful. thickness of his neck. So things came together quite quickly this morning. Thanks to Alistair for scouting for us. He found this bull, the one we've been after, um, pretty early this morning. He'll notice a wonderful Nyala bull, this very, very big, got classic shape with the ivory tips and these kickouts on the top. Got to about 250, um, managed to get prone, and Joe made two good shots. Yeah, you have a wonderful Nyala. Something that will go in your display room, make it look good, man. Yes. Congratulations. Thank you very much. On to bigger and better things. Cheers. Well done, man. Thank Cheers. You. Here we go, let's go take a look at this. We have now just entered the John X dining room. This is a beautiful dining room. This is where we actually have all of our dinners and meals and hang out and we've got the pub in there to hang out in after, uh, after the hunt. But the real thing I wanted to come in was show you all the different species of animals they have to offer here at John X. Um, you can look around the room and see that there's many different species to go after. Um, me being a taxidermist, I enjoy coming in and looking at all the animals up on the wall. Um, if you ever get a chance and you want to see some of the animals or you're interested in coming to John X, you can come by and see me at the shop. Uh, we can go over some of the animals you might be interested in and you can just kind of get a look at what they look like in, in real life because until you've actually seen the animal, just looking at a picture does not do it justice. A lot of beautiful animals. Um, my favorite is probably the water buck over here or uh, the kudu. Um, just want to say, beautiful place. It's been a fantastic time so far. We still have time to, uh, to continue our safari and our adventure. And hopefully uh, you can come over one day and, and get you a couple yourself.
looking for zebra, kudu and waterbuck all morning. Um, and no luck so far, but coming down the road here, we saw a very nice waterbuck just behind us here. So we can go take a look at him and then we'll carry on. But if we see him, we'll definitely try and get a shot on him. Back in Woodlands this morning, wind's going to get up this afternoon again. So while it's still relatively calm, we're going to give it a go. That spot there. There's a zebra getting up there. Okay. That's a water back now. Hey! Have a look at that. Woo! Put it there, Joe. That's freaking awesome, man. It's beautiful. See what I was talking about, about the op open at the top there, where that other one we saw was a bit narrower. Mm -hmm. Yes, but he's nice. Rock, rock, old, thick neck. A one shot kill. One shot. You know what we call that back home? <laughs> What's that? The bang flop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was. <laughs> where he stood, he died, the poor guy. It's evening now, on the 10th. We've got this beautiful, massive water back here. Um, the winds died down, so for the first time today, really, and you can see it's a lovely evening. And we came across this big waterbuck bull with a female. Um, we got to about 200 yards, put the sticks out. Joe did what he does. Bank flop. <laughs> Bank flop, man. <laughs> so we're back on the scoreboard now. Everything's working out. We're heading up to the Karoo tomorrow to Springbuck and Zebra, kudu, whatever else we find, we'll be there for a few days and then we'll come back down towards Woodlands again. But So we've got a bit of a drive in the early morning tomorrow. We'll see you again in the flat country. We just got to find where they are. I can see some over there in that area there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
stopped in for the middle of the gut. Yeah, shoot. Yes, please. Who's down? Yeah. Yes. Well done, dude. That was good shooting. It came out of the knife. What a shot. Put it there. That's a great animal. Oh, wow. He's so old and worn down. Put it there, man. That's a great black spring back. Hell. He's lost half an inch or so. Yeah. Look how beautiful these animals are. Man. See what I said? You want ni he's nice and thick. Mm -hmm. Then he turns and he's broomed off in that, but I mean, he's great. The old with a big thick neck. Very pleased. We're in the uh, Great Karoo area of South Africa. We left early this morning. It's very windy here today again. It seemed to be talking about the wind all the time, but very flat area and there are lots of these little springbuck. This is a black one, he's a particularly old one, very, very nice horns, he's actually broomed down quite a bit. Um, we saw him, he was on his own and we made a good stalk and we hustled around, got to about 270 and Joe made a wonderful bank flop shot. <laughs> <laughs> so we're pursuing after them, there are one or two more of them that we need to try and get and the day is still young so we have time yet. But well done Joe, this is a nice start to your career hunt. Thank you. Oh! <laughs> yes! <laughs> As we stood there, he looked at us. Yet we've shot some nice back here. Two nice ones. Old and clever. All right. Thank you. Awesome. Yeah, we have a wonderful trophy. A very, very nice white springback. Um, pearly white. He's just a bit red here from the soil and that, but his skin's a great color. He's nice and old. Got good secondary growth here. Um, very pleased to have him. We're going to take this guy and the black springback and get them skinned and head to camp which is at Ken Harry Game Reserve tonight. Um, and then we'll continue tomorrow, try and get the third springback in the slam.
Glenary Game Reserve is where we find ourselves this morning. It's a, in the Groffinet area. Got a multiple variety of Karoo species. Um, the sun's just coming up over the mountains. It's a beautiful morning. We're hopefully going to stumble upon a zebra and maybe even a, a springback if we get lucky. We arrived here last night. So we've got today to hunt and we'll be heading back to Woodlands tomorrow. So hopefully we can fill up the car with two more species and go back on a very successful trip to the north. You had a good night's rest last night, Joe? Fantastic. Joe's in the King Suite here, um, getting special treatment here this, this time round. Big room, one person. He says he's got two couches if you guys need to come stay with him. And a specialised breakfast. Yeah, <laughs> bacon this morning. Yeah, so we'll see what we can do before lunch. It's perfect. Perfect. Well done. Look at the spring back there. Look at the, look at the comb going up on the back here. There we go. Now it's standing up there, Joe. That's a damn nice spring back. That completes our slam. Well done, man. Thank you. Well done, Joe. That's very good. That will be the third of the three spring back. All of them very, very good ones. This one possibly the prettiest. It's our national animal in South Africa. We're very proud of it. This is a very nice springback. Um, yeah, we uh hunting here on these flats. They're called springback flats, this area. And funny enough, we found a good ram here. So, Joe made a good shot. And here we are. We can get him into the salt and then go look, after, look for Mr. Stripes.
goes on to him. It's at 400, that, so in case he presents us with a shot. It's 400, you hold on top of his back. Eh? The yellow one that you can see there. Okay, squeeze now, squeeze, squeeze. Yeah. Pumping out the neck, man. That'll do him. Woo! Well done. That was a tough one. There we go. What a steed. Good day, man. Well done. It took us a bit of a while to, to get him. We've been miles and miles on the property. Um, we finally got an opportunity at a large group of zebras. Joe made a good shot and we Bensi found him um, on the top of this little plateau here. Fortunately, we could drive to him here. It's a very nice zebra. It's an old stallion. Um, it'll look good in his shop. He's going to put a shoulder mount on him and keep the back out. I think that's all we needed up here, Joe, so we can head down to the Woodlands camp this afternoon or tomorrow morning and uh, we'll carry on down there. I just want to show Ivan. Come let the way to you. Look what's hiding behind you. <laughs> 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 okay, good show. <laughs> Well, Joe, that brings to an end a great safari. I've thoroughly enjoyed it. I don't know about you. We've taken some good animals. We've had fun most of the time, which is the most important thing. Yeah. Um, I'm sure you'll be back again for more. Shortly. It's nice to hear. We'll hunt again together. I know that. I said that from the beginning. But uh, I think it ends a great hunt sitting here at the fireplace. Um, we're going to have supper in a while and you guys have to leave early unfortunately tomorrow morning so it'll be an early night for the boys for a change but uh, I've enjoyed it immensely. Thanks very much. Thank you, it's been a uh, trip of a lifetime, you've been fantastic. Great and I think we started as sort of people that don't but be buddies now and we'll hunt again lots together man, it's been great. Yes we will. I've enjoyed hearing about your surf stories and your surfing 
And thanks to Granty for filming. He's done a great job. He's been behind the camera the whole time, but he's been with us every step of the way. So it's been great. Glad you chose John X, and I'm sure we'll do business again. For real. Thank you very much. You don't know how much I appreciate everything you've done. Cool, man. Only a pleasure, man. Yes. That's what we do.